Hello, my name is Suhail O'Day, or Firefighter O'Day as I will be referred to on my upcoming trainees course. I am 29 years old and for the past eight years I've worked as a bench joiner. And after eight years of working the same job, I really felt like it was time to do something new and to have a new challenge. I've always kind of been someone who's physically active, so I was, I was always going to the gym. Prior to the course, I've done a little bit more specific stuff, so like carrying weights as farmers carry. I use my old skiing salopettes and skiing jacket and some old boots just to kind of replicate the kit. So I was going to make it as specific as I could to what I'd be doing. Pre-course learning that we did before our first day, we were given on our induction day a little pack that had things like knots and lines in it, fire safety and fire science and a few other bits and pieces and you get tested on it as well in the first few weeks. So practicing that early doors definitely helps. So another thing I've got to do ready for my course is get on my uniform ironed. Not done a lot of ironing before, so this could take quite a while. So I can do I can do a shirt in about five minutes in the morning now. Um, so yeah, shirt and trousers in, in ten minutes. Whereas I think the first time it took me about four hours to do the whole the whole lot. Yeah. One of the modules was to learn the different ranks um, within the fire service. Yeah, those are the crew manager's epaulets. So uh, a way to help me revise for that, help me visualise it in my head, um, was to write it on a whiteboard on the different ranks. At station manager. So hopefully, when the course starts, I should, should know them all off by heart. That's the chief. <laughs> Too far off, there. yeah. <laughs> it's uh, quarter past nine uh, the night before I start my training course. I've had a nice clean shave, ready to go and um, I'm feeling excited I'm, I really can't wait. I'm a little bit nervous um, but yeah just more excited and focused ready for the, the challenge and the new adventure ahead. First day you kind of you get a bit wary kind of making small talk and then it probably about after the first week start to get to know each other a little bit more and a little bit more. The squad I mean have really come together we work really well as a team. It was my birthday during the course and they all came together and bought me a birthday cake so it's, it's little things like that that kind of show you how much you kind of gelled as a team and it meant quite a lot to me that. So just a quick update, um, it's been five weeks since I started the trainees course, I can't believe it's gone by that quickly. Uh, we've done so much in that, that first five weeks, we've done hose running, we've done pumps, we've done ladders, we've done combination drills, we've been set up with different scenarios to go out to and it's been, it's been so much fun. One step closer to becoming a fully fledged firefighter. Yeah, the trainers are easy to approach. If you've got any problems, you can go and talk to them or when they're trying to teach something, if you don't get it, I don't feel like embarrassed to say, oh no, I don't understand that. It's, it's so easy to go, oh, can you show me that again? And having the feedback from the watch managers and crew managers telling us, oh yeah, you've started here and you've, you've now finished there and you've come along leaps and bounds. Knowing that we've all kind of completed the same thing, we've all learned something out there, we've all kind of done it to a, a good standard as well. Right, so that's... Four weeks of BA done. Um, what can I say about BA? It's hard, hard work. It's physically hard and it's mentally hard, but it is so enjoyable and rewarding at the same time. So you go into work and be a little bit apprehensive, a bit nervous about what's going to happen. Have a great day, have a good laugh, and come away laughing and smiling again. So you can't really ask for much more. A lot of people that I've talked to that have been in the fire service 20, 25 years and they all say it's the best job in the world, which fills me with confidence as well. The variety of different work you're going to be doing, it's very impactful and helpful. You're going to be saving people's lives, you're going to be making the community safer. It's a dream job, so it's kind of it's really rewarding knowing it's going towards that.